Okay, so after the sound check on a clean channel of an amplifier, uh, honestly, I find that I think the Fender Affinity Strat uh, sounds a whole lot better than the Hard Luck King's bombshell guitar. Uh, the electronics in the Fender are a little better quality. Uh, when I plugged in, uh, I've got no static or pops or anything out of the Fender. When I plugged into the Hard Luck King's guitar, uh, it hissed and popped quite a bit. Uh, needless to say, a lot of you may be asking, okay, well, how about doing a comparison on a dirty channel? I tried that, and honestly, the Fender sounds okay, but this stock pickup, this humbucker, it's lacking. It's not really good. Uh, both guitars right now on a clean channel will work fine. Um, the Fender does sound better, but, uh, you know, if you're into just playing clean or slightly driven clean tones uh, either guitar would work um, I'm probably going to keep this Fender as is it, it is just a practice guitar for when somebody comes over and they want to jam or learn some riffs that kind of thing uh, I just keep it around for giggles the uh, Hard Luck Kings guitar it's a total mess uh, after playing it and comparing it to the fender, I find the neck on it uh, is actually going to need to be refretted and dressed. And uh, plus the nut's got to be replaced. And I'm going to have to shave uh, some of the uh, joint area of the body and a little bit off of the neck to get it to sit down further on the guitar. Uh, a whole lot more work than I ever intended. And honestly, again, for 100 bucks, it's nothing more than a parts guitar at this point. Uh, something to build on and that's it. Now, I've watched other videos on YouTube. And uh, the ones I watched, half of them are positive and half of them are negative. And unfortunately... My conclusion, based on this guitar, is that they're very poor quality. And if you're looking for something that's playable with just tuning uh, right out of the box, save your money and get something a little better. Uh, the Hard Luck Canes guitars need work, and you'll be sadly disappointed when you open the box, tune it up, and try to play it. It's not worth it. Uh, unless, of course, you're like me and you want to basically rebuild it and make it into what you think it should be. With that in mind, uh, I figure it'll take me a couple months and, uh, you know, I'll rebuild it and get it to where I want it. And who knows, maybe I'll do a little video series going through the different steps of the... Uh, the modifications I make to it. Uh, that could be fun. So, as far as this uh, video goes, yes, the definite winner, in my opinion, and probably most of you that actually listened, uh, is the Fender. The, uh, well, technically a Squire by Fender, Affinity Strat. Uh, so, as far as the $100 guitar shootout goes, this one's the winner. Uh, hard Luck Kings, Sorry, but build a better product. And, uh, you know, at least you could compete with this. Anyway, uh, so I'm going to let you go. All right. Peace, rock on, and later.